Hey guys, my name's Caleb, and welcome to the channel. Today I'm gonna to be talking to you about my custom carbon fiber wing design, so let's get into it. So let's go over why I decided to make my own wing. When I got the car, I think the wings look great on a WRX, but every, every WRX decides to put an SDI wing on their car. So what I wanted to do is be different and make my own. In my eyes, just putting the SDI wing was a very mainstream thing to do. I decided I wanted to, I wanted to do something special and make my own wing. STIs have a good look. I love the wing on there, but everyone who owns a WRX decides to put an STI wing on it. It's easy. You just drill a couple holes and you're done. There's no thought into it. In my eyes, I wanted to be different and not do the mainstream thing. So there's a couple options. I could go with the aftermarket design and use something else that somebody else has, which I could do, but I don't really like the, the aftermarket support for the WRX wings. So the other option is make my own. So that's what I'm gonna share with you today. Some of the inspirations I decided to take from is using an older, older style wing but on a new chassis, on the VA chassis. So what I decided to do was the Bug Eye STI wing and also some flavor from the 22B wing itself. I wanted to make a touch of modern but put the old wing into that touch of modern also. So let's get into the designs that I have down on paper. Just, these are just some rough sketches of what the design could look like. So the first design is a one piece hoop. All it is is the wing goes over top and it also is flat on the trunk itself. The second design is a two piece hoop. The top portion is the wing and stabilizers itself and the bottom part is what mounts to the trunk. The third design is a wing that is all one piece and it mounts the two stabilizers mount to the trunk on e either side. The fourth design is a three piece wing mount where the two sta stabilizers are separate and the airfoil itself mounts to the stabilizers. It's sort of similar to how the STI wing mounts, but slightly different. So after having all these ideas down on paper, I decided to put them in a design matrix to see which one I would actually go with. As you can see here, there's 10 different requirements that the wing had to meet, and it's on a scale from one to five. The first one is looks. Of course, everybody wants it to look good. Some of the requirements that I went with is looks, ease of printing, ease of laying the carbon over the 3D print model, assembly, the strength of the, the design itself, the size, modularity, which the modularity would be changing out different airfoils, different angles of attack, amount of material, and also ease of modeling. After this, as you can see here, the totals came out to be 28, 29, 28, and 20, 34, with a three-piece wing design coming out on top. So the plan is I'm gonna be 3D printing this out of PETG, and then putting it on the car, seeing what needs to be changed, seeing what needs to be moved around, and then after that, taking it, laying carbon fiber over the 3D print itself, and using the 3D print as a plug, and leaving it in there as some somewhat of a structural support, making it easy so I don't have to make a mold or anything. It's just a one-off piece to begin with. Thank y'all for tuning in and let me know what you think about the project and be sure to check out more videos on the progress updates so far. Hey guys, I just wanted to show you some future content on some of the videos I have planned. Here's a little sneak peek. Thanks for watching. Y'all have a good day.